uh, hi and hello guys so i have got something very interesting to share with you all uh, today in this video so as a person who is constantly trying out new things on the raspberry pi uh, boards i always end up uh, flashing the os time and again by plugging out the sd card and inserting it to the windows the usual process that you all do okay so uh, i was tired of this and i was looking out for a method wherein we can factory reset the OS just like how we do it on the Android systems or Android devices. So then I stumbled upon this piece of article which outlines a method to generate uh, your own image with a built-in factory reset option. So I tried it out. So this was primarily centered around the stretch version and so obviously it didn't work for the buster. So I ended up uh, tinkering with the codes and putting up my own git. Um, and this one right now works with almost all versions of the Raspbian OS or the Raspberry Pi OS as what we call now. Okay. So uh, to make things easy for you guys, I have already prepared two versions of the images. One is the light version and another one is the desktop version uh, with the built in factory reset option. And uh, you can find the download links for them in the description of this video. These files that I have attached in the description of this video is quite large. And so if you want to generate your own images, you can follow the steps that I have given in the Git uh, on a Linux system. Okay, so this doesn't work on Windows. You need to have a Linux uh, machine. And if you follow these steps, you will end up um, with a Raspberry Pi OS, which has an option to factory reset. Okay, so without any further delay, let us take a quick look at the uh, demo or working of this factory reset option. So as you can see over here, I have changed the default wallpaper on the Raspberry Pi. I have also uh, started the VNC server and uh, I have got some additional files in the home slash pi directory and I have got certain packages installed as well. And uh, I have increased the size of the font on the terminal as well. So to factory reset the file, the command is sudo space su. And then forward slash boot forward slash factory hyphen reset space double hyphen reset. Okay. So that is it guys. So that is how now you can factory reset your Raspberry Pi OS. Okay. Uh, so just a thing that I would like to point out is uh, for this process to work efficiently, uh, you should have the original version of the kernel. Okay. So if you change the kernel version or if you tamper the kernel version, the restoration will work. but not with optimum performance okay so just make a note of that uh, it's just that you need to have the original uh, kernel version as with the os okay so that is pretty much it 
i really hope that you find this uh, video useful and informative and i really hope that you try it out okay so thanks for watching take care and bye bye